and I can't even explain it. What happened? I just can tell you my honest reaction. That was the reaction from 23-year-old Jalen Brazer at his sentencing Wednesday in a Macomb County courtroom for lying to East Point police about the investigation into 17-year-old East Point resident Zion Foster missing since January 5th and still missing today. One minute, she was cool, she was fine, she laid back for a minute. Next, next thing I know, she's just, she's, she was dead. I don't know what caused it. I did not cause it. Brazier admitted that he found Zion dead, but he's not charged with her murder. Instead, Brazier admits that he threw the dead body in a dumpster. Reacted stupidly off of fear and panic like I've never felt before in my life. But when Zion's mother spoke, she didn't believe Brazier at all. It wasn't too long ago that I saw you. And even knowing that my baby has been in contact with him, I kept going to his house. I just wanted him to tell me the truth. Facebook, everything, just a lie hitting me at once. So I had to just take time and try to get my thoughts together because I was on panic mode ever since that happened. But the judge laid down the truth. Perverted, I cannot believe what this family has been through. That is before this court. The judge went above sentencing guidelines and sentenced Brazier to 23 months to four years in prison. He'll get credit for the 66 days he's already served in jail. However, if the body shows up or more evidence is found, Brazier could be recharged, and that could be murder. In Mount Clemens, Charlie Langton, Fox 2 News.